Hey you guys, it's Michelle here. Thanks for joining me today and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna flip through some new items from Planny Thing. This is the spring launch. I've got sticker books, notepad, and some washi. So I'm gonna do a flip through and a plan with me. So stay tuned if you wanna check it out. products are available today. I'm going to show you each one of them. This Seasonal Vibes sticker book is so adorable. It's all illustrated by Amber herself, and I'll be sure to include my Planny Thing affiliate link in the description, and I always appreciate your support when you shop through that link at no extra cost to you, but I'm going to go ahead and push these aside and start flipping through. Let's look at Seasonal Vibes first. I'm so excited about this book because I love all things seasonal and it's spring now. And so I'm so excited to use these, the spring illustrations in here. So I am going to be doing my currently sheet for April after I show you all of the new goodies. So let's go ahead and take a look. It's going to start out with winter. So we're going to have some piles of snow that are kind of cut for the corner, little hills of snow, some snowflakes, love the trees and the girls playing in the snow. There's even a little snowman. So you're going to get two pages of everything. All right. And then we've got some adorable holiday sweaters and little beanies and ice skates and boots and all the things that you wear in the winter. I love the colors on this too, the pretty kind of pinkish purple and teal. We've got even some mittens holding a warm cup of coffee or tea. Look at the new year, so cute. So we've got 2024, we've got some little sparkles or glitter, the champagne toasts, a little banner, some gifts, some Christmas trees, so like holiday, like Christmas and New Year's stickers. And I love that there are two. Then you're gonna have all the boxes that go with that particular season. So we're gonna have all those colors, that navy blue, that really deep kind of cranberry and like hunter green. Then we've got some lighter colors and I love that pop of that purpley pink. So we'll have a long box, two full boxes, three slender, two of the rectangle and then one of the double and four circles. So two pages of that. And look for spring, the little watercolor butterflies and flowers and even the rainbow is so cute. And how cute are these bees? So, so cute, two of those. And then we're gonna go into like the springtime Easter section. Love the little carrots on the little banner or garland. Then we've got flowers, bunnies, little chicks, little sheep. All the Easter things, Easter baskets. Those are so cute. Easter eggs. And then more for spring, we've got the super cute trees and even like the little grass and flowers and the little paved uh, walkway like cobblestone. Got some folks having a picnic out here. Little ducks in a pond. Someone walking their dog. Here's a girl on a bike. And I love the little street lamps. So two of those, and then look how pretty the boxes are that go with those. It's gonna be that same format that we saw in the, the winter boxes, but different colors. And let's look at summer, my absolute favorite. We've got some palm trees, of course. Love the little bathing suit, little tropical drinks. We've got some little patches of sand and water. Got someone hanging out here on a hammock. Just all the fun little summery things, a surfboard, a float, love that little umbrella. So two of those, and then we've got two swimming pools and a little ice cream cart, all the summery things. So, so cute. I love the little chairs even, and the little slide, and there's a girl in her car here. So two of those, and then these are the boxes that go with the summer. Really pretty color palette. And look at fall, so beautiful. Oh, I love the leaves. I always, I can never get enough leaves when fall rolls around. So we're gonna have all the different color leaves. And then here we've got someone playing in the leaves, someone at a pumpkin patch, piles of leaves, small leaves and acorns and little mushrooms. Love the little squirrel, sweaters, the little pumpkin spice latte. So cute. 
Look at the Halloween stuff. Oh, I love the little cobwebs. Got some little friendly ghosts, little pumpkins, candy corn, spiders, bats, the little witch shoes and the broom. Two of those. And then we've got the fall boxes and all of those pretty warm tones. So that's the Seasonal Vibes book. I absolutely love it. Can't wait to use the spring stickers in my currently sheet today. But I'm gonna go ahead and show you next a really good functional book. This is called Plain Rainbow Pastel Boxes. I love this because I can never have enough boxes. And I love that these are shaded and all those pretty pastel colors because that's what I use the most. So instead of the regular boxes with, with it being shaded around the frame and white in the middle, this is all solid. I love these for layering and using functionally. So first we're gonna have three of the full boxes and then six of the rectangle, then three of like the half size or quarter boxes, and then six of the slender boxes in this coral, this orange, and this yellow. So two pages of everything. Then in that same format, we're gonna have the blue, the green, and then like sort of like a pale grayish blue. These colors are great. Then next we're gonna go into like the, almost like a peachy pink, a lavender, and more of a, just a pink. And we're gonna have six of the longer boxes in all those colors. Another sheet of those. And then th this is usually, the, this is the color palette I lean towards a lot. I really love these colors. So we're gonna have six of those, another page of that. Then we're gonna go into the circle stickers and we're gonna have four different sizes. So 12 of the smaller, and then 12 of these that are a little bit larger, eight of the next size up, and then four of the larger size. Two of those, and then that same format in the circles in those blue colors, blues and greens. In the peach, purple, and pink. Oh, the big circles. I didn't see these before. These are so cool. So we're going to have six of the big circles in all those colors. Really big. And then six in these colors. And then we're going to go into the hexagons. So three sizes, no, four sizes in these. So the smaller size, the next size up, a little bit larger, and then three of those in those colors, and then in the blue, same thing in the blue and green, and then in the, and then in the peach and the lavender and pink, and then six of the really large hexes in those, those colors, actually it's 12, and then 12 more in the pink, peach, and lavender. So that is gonna be a book that I reach for a lot. I love the pastel colors. So those are the two sticker books available. And now I wanna show you the notepad. Y'all, it's so cute. I love, I always have a plenty thing notepad on my desk because they're so cute and they're just great to jot something down on them. But it's got those bees that I love so much up in the corner. And then a little scene down here, hanging out outside with the picnics, walking the dogs and a girl riding her bike. So it's gonna be lined with that purple on, or like lavender around the border and it's gonna be front and back. And it's a pretty chunky pad. One of these lasts me quite a while, so I'm so excited to use that one. And then, y'all, there's new washi tapes. There are gonna be six of this grid washi, which is my favorite, I love it. So we're gonna have like the, the like lime green with white grid, and then the reverse of that, white with lime green, then the pink with white, and the white with pink, and then the blue with white grid, and then the white with the blue grid. And I'll show you these on paper after I show you all of them. But those are the six grid washi tapes available. But we've got the butterflies and those pretty watercolor colors, and then we've got the little hedgehogs, it's adorable, a little dog chasing a ball, some leaves, then we've got for New Year's, like a New Year's celebration, the holiday sweaters. And then for Halloween, we have those little witch boots in those Halloween colors. Aren't those cute? So there's 13 washi tapes. And this is what they look like on paper. It's 
These are all the same size, and this one is about the same size as that one, and the others are a bit wider. But aren't those fun? All right, so now that we've looked at all the goodies, I'm gonna go ahead and get started on my April Currently sheet. Let's see. So let's get to the spring section. I think I want to use these. Those are so pretty. And I've got my just my little quotes book that I have collected from all different books and also some I made on the Cricut. I have a couple of spring ones here. I love this one that says spring is good for the soul. So I think I want to do that right there and this and this watercolor rainbow. and put this more toward the middle, like right here. Okay, let's do this green flower right here. larger one. Right here. And then I want to bring in some of that washi. So I think I like this green. All right, and I'm gonna grab one of these little chicks from like the next page. That's so cute. And how about a bunny at the bottom since Easter is this month. I think I'll do him right here. have a little Easter basket beside him. And then I think I will do the boxes that come in here. So I'm gonna do this. This is what I typically do for a currently sheet for like birthdays and special events and then do my currently prompts over here. So let me cover that writing up right here. Okay. okay. And now I think over here I'm gonna use some of these boxes. Or 
or maybe circles. Let's see. Let's do the, let's do like the lavender. Right over here. Okay, and then let's do also this one. Oh, I really like these. Okay, and let's do the rest of that up here. And let's get one of the smaller blue. Right here. And then a little green. Oh, it's cute. Okay, and let's do one this size over here. I'm gonna cut that in half and put that right here. And then use a larger, like this orangish color. Let's do a smaller pink. thinking about adding another washi with it, like the pink. Just kind of layered over the top of it. And I'll just cut out around this flower. Okay. Oh, I think that's cute. I might end up switching this to one of the shaded ones because it bothers me that they're different. So I'm gonna put this flower back and the chick back. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Let's switch it to a shaded one. this. So over here, what would we like to do? Oh, I'm kind of thinking the green. Move this up because this box is a bit shorter. Move that B. thinking about another circle here, like a blue this size. Oh, 
Oh, that's cute. I'm digging it. Let's do another green one too. And up here, let's do some more flowers and stuff. Let's get another, let's get this yellow flower. that right there. Oh, we don't have any yellow. Let's move the carrot here and the Easter eggs over here. probably won't write anything in that, but that looks cute there. And then maybe a smaller purple circle here. We'll do that one there. Oh, I just thought of something. I can put that birthdays and holidays on a different color box. Like maybe the light blue. Or what about this pinkish color? Let's scoot it over a little bit. Okay, that's cute. Now I wanna go ahead and draw some lines in this. And I think we'll do some in the purple one and maybe this blue one. I'm gonna get that wider stencil from the Happy Planner that has a little bit of longer lines. Okay, that's good. Now we need to fill in over here, about to finish up. Do that flower there. I 
and the rest of that there. Let's do this green one that's already cut for the corner right here. And another little B. And I wanna just have some flowers kind of around these circles. this purple flower right down here. Another flower here. I just thought of something. I think I want to have two chicks. That one and then a smaller one. Cute! That's adorable. Okay, and then a few more flowers and we're going to be good to go. Do this little orange one. We'll do a little orange coming out of this one. Let's do another butterfly. That one there. Do this one under the hit coming out from under this one. Maybe one more half of a circle, or not even a half, an entire half there in the pinkish color. Perfect. And let's get a flower over here by this bunny. Let's do this smaller orange flower. All right, I'm going to go ahead and punch it. I think that's all I'm going to add to it. All right, and that's going to be my currently sheet. Oh my gosh, I love it. I can't wait to fill it in. I just love how it turned out. Before I go, I want to give a couple of patron birthday shout outs. It was Nicole's birthday on the 25th and Shelly's birthday on the 27th. I hope you guys had a wonderful birthday. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me while I flip through these goodies and put my April currently sheet together. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye.